All right, Pisces. Let's see what's going on with the Pisces. This is going to be a timeless reading. Holy Spirit, angels and guides, God, Ooh, universe, ancestors, and the highest of the most high, you are welcome into this reading for the sign of Pisces. Let's see what messages we got for you guys today. Today is November 9th, 2023. So you guys got the cross, number six, number five, you got number seven out here, number 10 and 15. <clears throat> Distant horizons, oh. occupation, <clears throat> one more. One more face for Pisces, timeless reading. All right, so you guys got the cross. Whoa, you guys got 36, 36. Two number 36s falling right below one another. A lot of threes also. So you guys may be seeing three, 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 33, 33. All right, so the cross. I am the bringer of grief, sadness, and burdens, and ordeals, pain, and suffering, and guilt are the area of my expertise. I claim weeping, tears, and lamentations, and I ask for prayers and supplications. S supplications? Okay, when happy cards are at my right, you shouldn't experience too much fright. Okay. Ew. let's see number five the tree i'm here to stay i'm here to grow i am health of your mind body and soul look for the cards next to me to find out more about me when negative cards are close pack some tissues for your nose hmm and then number 15 with the polar bear. The polar bear is a good card. I am power. I am strength. I am health and protection. Your finance is my field. Your food is my concern. My bad side comes out when you see negative cards around. And then you got adjudication. Interesting. So I don't know what to take of this reading, Pisces. Um, something here may be going on with your occupation, your job. This is in the distant horizons. So let's see. Let's see, shall we? So why is the cross here? Holy Spirit, why is the cross here? Two to three cards to clarify. So three cups. Page of swords. Oh, and the four swords. Okay. Uh, Pisces, I don't know if this is a friend of yours or a sibling. Um, You have bad health on the bottom of the deck. <clears throat> Mature woman underneath that. So I don't know who this is in your energy with this three of cups, page of swords, but there may be a need to like, the page of swords can be some type of news information, document, letter, maybe about someone's health, okay? And this may be somebody who, I don't know, show me this three of cups. Show me the three of cups, please. These pentacles. Okay. Mm. Uh, 
For some of you, this is someone in your family. Um, but someone here could be in bad health. Um, let's see. Why is it four swords? Two cups. Yeah, whoever this is, this is someone who you love. Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Uh, for some of you, this could be a child. Um, show me adjudication. Hold on a second, y'all, because I'm getting two separate messages, completely different. <clears throat> keep going. Uh, show me adjudication. Show me adjudication, please. Five of Cups. Ugh, I hate giving terrible readings. Like, I truly do, but, you know, terrible shit happens, so... Um, there could be something going on in court or something to do with someone's occupation. I don't know if this is, something here is closing in or something here is ending. A major cycle is coming to a close. Um, and it's gonna be sad, I feel like. Like, it's gonna bring some type of sadness, despair, heartbreak, grief, pain, Priestess, four cups. What is this about? What are we talking about? Why is a tree here? Tree. Show me distant horizons. I'm trying to figure out <clears throat> what the high priest is. So you're going to have to, you know, use your intuition, Pisces, about something. There could be something here that is hidden, but maybe intuitively you may feel or know. Um, I don't know. I feel like there's, there's something here that's sad or it's going to be, and it may have to, it has something to do with someone that you love. Like, I don't know who, and I almost feel like for you with this high priestess, we just have the ace of wands, chariot, page, page of cups. There could be something here that's moving forward for you, but I feel like it comes with some type of And then again, the Nine of Cups, the Eight of Swords, Seven of Swords. So if someone, you know, flip the roles, cross, cross watchers, I feel like if there was someone here who was being sneaky, deceitful, um, Yes. Okay. So like I was feeling, okay. So the wheel of fortune with the high priestess, distant horizons, there's something here, some type of a cycle closing out. And again, like I'm going to say it again, cross watchers flip the roles according to your situation. But in this reading, this looks like Pisces, something is going in your favor. Um, 
Four of Pentacles. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Ten of Cups. I feel like you're manifesting some type of happiness, but there's something here. It's almost like someone regrets some type of a choice and there's some type of choices that were made. Something here could, you know, have to deal with the court or the judge. What's this five of cups? Seven of pentacles. What's the lovers? So cool. So someone here may have taken a risk. Gemini energy is here, Aries. Someone here, I feel like, took a risk, made some type of a choice that they regret. And it may have had something to do with, like, finances, protecting finances, or something. Like, someone took a risk and invested into something, and they made a major decision, a major life choice, and they regret it. Okay? There could be some type of legalities here. Now, show me the Seven of Swords. The Nine of Pentacles. <clears throat> Eight of Swords. It's almost like someone made a choice. So, okay, so someone could have lied about being single, being independent, doing, you know, like this is almost like somebody... Um, keeping up with the Joneses in some way. Um, someone made a conscious choice to bind themselves to something for some type of wish fulfillment, but I feel like they regret this, taking this risk, because there could be some type of court shits going on. Something here about holding on to your happiness, Pisces. Keeping your moves silent. Some of you could be saving up for something. Some type of move or something that's some saving up for something that's going to bring you emotional fulfillment. Whatever that is. Show me this polar bear. Actually, don't show me the polar bear. Show me this page of swords over here because I want to know what this is about. This Two of swords and the six of coins reversed. What's the six of coins reversed? So this is almost like somebody is, yeah. This is like somebody that maybe celebrated some type of a new opportunity, a relationship, something that they were excited about, optimistic about. Like, it's almost like somebody went looking for something that could help heal them in some aspect. But there was something here that someone didn't see and there's some type of a loss of generosity, loss of finances that's coming to an end. So if somebody was the generous part of a situation, what was generous, somebody didn't see something and now someone's losing money because something's coming to an end. or losing resources, or losing value, assets, um, something of value.
Show me the poor bear. Five of Pentacles, Eight of Cups wanting to show itself. Somebody somebody did something like out of a state of lack or someone walked away because of some type of financial problems and went to something or did something that brought in some type of protection. I don't know how else to say that, but whatever that is. And... Yeah, this is almost like somebody somebody moved away from a situation. Like somebody did. I feel like whoever did whatever, and I don't know who, but this this has to do with something. You have six 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 showing up. Something someone did something in the past, and they moved away from a situation for some type of success or achievement or reward or whatever because they were going through some type of financial poverty hardship lack health problems whatever somebody you know honestly i feel like somebody did what they thought was best at the moment in time but now they regret it why i don't know Yeah, I'm just going to leave it here. But Ten of Cups, the Four of Pentacles, and the Wheel of Fortune. I feel like someone's trying to hold, either Pisces, you're trying to hold on to something here, or there was some type of faded happiness, something, someone held back from it, held back from you, or someone's trying to hold on to something. Um, like the Wheel of Fortune, the Ten of Cups, and the High Priestess, that's, that's some, like, strong... Faded, happy energy. Give me one on this four of pentacles. Why are we picking up on passion today? Like, ugh, chariot. Some of you are saving up for a vehicle, a new car. Temperance. Sagittarius Cancer energy. Determined to move forward and heal. Holding back. Who's determined? Show me the four pentacles. I mean, yeah, show me the chariot. Queen of Wands, Ace of Cups. And Ace of Wands. Knight of Cups. Hangman. Aerophon. Tower, Ten of Swords, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, someone did something in the past for some type of financial gain, and I feel like someone's now trying to either come towards you and to create some type of peace or balance or harmony. Um, this is someone who's either been holding on to you or you've been holding on to this person. But I feel like someone's wanting to take action towards some type of a new passionate, emotional beginning. Knight of Cups come rushing in because they've had some type of realization. The hair font. Hey, someone's wanting some type of commitment. Maybe wanting to express their feelings and apology. Blah, blah, blah. <clears throat> But there's something here going through a tower, maybe with, you know, someone who they were committed to, married to. Could be a divorce or separation or um, could be an ex. Whatever this is, it has something to do with the past and some type of financial gain. But I feel like it's coming to an end now. Or something here is shifting or changing. Someone may also feel blocked from moving forward. It's like someone needs to take control of the situation and lead. How do I say that? Like lead with love. Okay. I don't know if someone reconciled with someone. 
um, or there was some type of information here that was seen, discovered, or someone went looking for a way to to do something and they found a way to do something and then they did it and now they regret it because I feel like someone's emotions may have changed. But I kind of feel like somebody, yeah, something here had to do with like an occupation, maybe even someone's like health or, um, I feel like someone did what they thought was best at the moment in time, but now they're looking back and I feel like they, they don't feel the same. So, yeah. All right, let's get three cards from the Alice in Wonderland. I'm going to close this reading out. Wait. The reading was weird. Yeah, and that's why that cross was the first card out. Shine bright like a candle. You will make it through this. Uh, uncertainty. Choose who you will become. And you can't go back to yesterday being the present. Yeah, exactly. I feel like someone here is like, they regret some type of a choice that they made. Made. It's like, you can't go back to the past. There is some type of certainty here. Um, but Spirit is, you know, saying, shine bright like a candle. You will make it through whatever this is. Or whoever is, whoever I feel like something here happened for a reason. Like, I feel like it was almost like faded. It was meant to happen this way. For what reason? I'm not sure. But something was meant to go down the way it went down. But I do feel like somebody, and even if it's not like somebody looking back with regret, it's like you're disappointed with something, wanting to go back to how something was, but whatever has happened, it created some type of change for the better, but someone may not be looking at it like that. Someone may be looking at a situation by like what was lost rather than what was gained. Okay, Pisces, I love you guys. I hope that this helped. If it did, let me know. Boy, hit that thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.